I believe got... Russ. Russ has got that, that innocent look. Yeah. I like it. So here we got the run back. Oh, this is not hand warmers. Whoa. Is this it is this is I oh, thought we're this going is, into we're it. just going we just went straight All into right, it. Uh, we missed the first stock. Blaya not happy. No, Blaya <laughs> losing. Blaya's just like, hey, uh, just so you know. Just so you know. <laughs> what happened earlier, that that was a fluke. You were not meant to loot not not going to lose his bracket. <laughs> this Oh my gosh. Alright, um Granted Sheik also a pretty bad matchup for Luigi. Oh yeah, for sure. I think. Uh, no, I, I, I definitely think this is a bad match. Okay. I think Sheik just kind of shuts down a lot of his ground game with needles. Uh, yeah. And then just... Even F-Tilt. Luigi doesn't have the best range, and he has to really rely on baiting out something yeah. and wave dashing in. But Sheik doesn't have a lot of lag on her tilts. It's really yeah. hard to get in against Sheik. So actually what I... I don't know. Play is recovered this, so this good. Could be, oh my gosh. This could be just me being a scrub. Um, but from what I understand... And I have yet to really find like a good counter to this. Sheik can actually pretty freely just like down smash, like actually just crouch cancel Luigi's down smash and then down smash in response. Really? And then Luigi can't really do anything about that because if he shields or crouch cancels, he will be too far out of range. After well, things like get pushed too far away. His wave dash is pretty fast. His wave no, dash is pretty he, fast. he can't wave dash out of shield on the down smash and grab. Down smash just doesn't have that much end lag. But like, all right. This is my theory crafting because I don't play either of these characters. But Luigi's shield traction very small, or very yeah, very small. He does he goes super far yeah, he goes when you hit far. when you hit his shield. So he might be out of the sheik down smash by like the first hit. Yeah. So if he times the wave dash in, he could get it right. Uh, in theory, yes. But I, I will say it is difficult. Oh yeah, for sure. I mean, punishing sheik in general is difficult because she's not very laggy. No, and she's, she's very ground-based. She is very You ground want to catch her in the air, but a good Sheik like Shaman's not going to go in the air. Except there. <laughs> All right. So, yeah, sh I've actually noticed Shaman is full hopping a lot, which I don't think is a bad strategy, but I think you need to force your opponent to respect your short hop first. Because I think the issue with full hopping against Luigi is it's so easy for Luigi to oh, just wave dash underneath you and then just up smash or something. Yeah, um... Full, oh. hop, full hop generally only gets bad when they start, like, reading you or catching you out of it. Yeah. Um, like... If he does that full hop in air and then Blaya just comes in perfectly with a timed down air. Oh, edge guards. Right, yeah. you... Shaman kind of gave that up. He's yeah. like, I'm at, I'm at 110 on my last stock. Blaya's got two more. Yeah. Oh, Blaya. Look, oh, look at those Blake eyes. Look at those like, eyes. Yo. yo. <laughs> just so you know. Blaya's like, you are not on my level. Yeah. I gave you that win in winner's bracket. Uh, this is a new story. Yeah, enjoy your one win. It's the only one you'll ever get. Ooh. She's going for a lot of forward throw. Does uh, he not have conversion left down throw or up throw? Um, I don't know how often you play a Luigi or Blaya. Um, you know, I, I feel like he has like pretty solid conversions off of up throw at like a lot of percents. At this, perc at this percent, maybe not. Uh, but I will say up throw like does seem like a fine strategy anyway, just because like it's chic, dude. Like, what's she gonna do? You, you I mean, up throw, Luigi, like, Luigi not the best at juggling characters. His up air is like good, but it doesn't have a lot of priority. Okay, so oh, uh, smart, good edge guard. I, I think it's not necessarily like Luigi's ability to juggle. I think it's more like Luigi's ability to be where you land and Ooh, then hit you okay. with like, a, like an up smash or, makes or sense. down smash or something. Um, but yeah, it seems like uh, when Blaya gets the grab, he's just opting for okay, maybe up throw is just super low percents. But at the higher percents, he seems to be opting for just stage control. Like, he wants uh, Shaman in the corner. Oh, yeah. All right, but that's fine. He still gets a conversion. I mean, it's not fine. He could have killed him off an edge guard. Well, right, but okay. <laughs> yeah, like, in that sense, yes. A misfire is always unfortunate for the person fighting Luigi, unless it's on Yoshi's. <laughs> uh, yeah. But yeah, that was okay. an easy nair out of shield. Uh, Blea did not space his second aerial. A rare miss from the god. Uh, oh, he he's needed. so smart. I mean, he's dead, uh, yeah. but that was the only way he could live. It was smart. Um, I actually don't agree with that down smash. I think he should have gone for the re-grab or up smash. Oh, he got the spike. The spike came out on Luigi's Dare. I love Luigi's Dare. Luigi's Dare is so sick. Actually, Dude, I love how does he Luigi's do Dare. it? Like, have you ever looked at the animation? He, like, twists his legs, but his even, torso I, doesn't move. I don't even know, dude. I really don't understand. Oh, Luigi's uh, just, he's an he, enigma. He, but Ooh, smart, smart, new, smart, he saw he was late on the catching the landing. Mm -hmm. And he knew that Shemont was going to be able to shield. And if he knew if he hit the shield, Shemont was going to be able to nair out. So smart, good reactions by Blea to not hit the shield, but rather try and wait out a reaction. 
Oh, good dick. Oh, oh god. I had to grab ledge okay. personally. Yeah, but, but uh, the, the, the the slide up, you know, bear has actually been working a lot versus Shamai. And That's it's true. so much cooler. That's true. It is cooler. I it's agree. so much cooler. Alright, you know. Yeah, space aerials work so well against Luigi. Um, yeah, it become it becomes the mix up if uh they're gonna he's gonna try and wave dash out and punish you, or if he's just gonna take it and drop shield and reset neutral. Yeah, but the mix up being if you try and catch his wave dash in, you have to throw out a preemptive F tilt or like jump in the air, and if he waits that out, then you're caught in the air, you're caught in lag. Oh, that was super good by Tommy. Smart. Shaman, sorry. Shaman. Shaman. Both TGL. This is a team kill. Oh, this is a team kill. Well, technically, uh, well, oh, ta Shaman right. is the owner of TGL, so actually, I don't even know if this is like a team kill or like a <laughs> em employee employer yeah. kill. Yes. Yeah. Oh no. Your boss, well, man. you can't just kill your boss. Come on. Well, you I, can't I, kill the person that's funding you to yeah. go to tournaments. Come on. Because I'm pretty sure he's just sponsored because he won a TGL, right? Is that how that works? No. No. no he he actually works for TGL. Yeah, yeah. He's Smart. actually sponsored. All right, by Tom. Nice. Once upon a time, Drug Fox was sponsored by TGL. <laughs> Once upon a time. Man, I love Sammy. He's a nice oh, guy. he could have just waited. He should have just oh. led ledge dash and gone for the hard up air. Yeah. And he, oh, he had the fair. A little bit slow. That was the first time he's gone to ledge all set, as far as I know. Okay, I was going to say, why, why'd you up there there? You could have just fared and killed him. But I guess he got it. Right. This is rough. No, this because is Luigi, much like every other character, can crouch cancel Sheik. So Not he's really got to get him up to like 50. Oh, Yo, that he's was got genius. it. He's got it. All right, he's out of the crouch cancel percent. Now he just needs solid. Oh, control. no. He wanted the drop down fair, missed the drop down of yeah. forward smash instead. That would have been a conversion, too. If he, like oh. that fair, I think, would have connected. Oh, that's rough. That's Where's he going to go? Fountain? No. Uh, I, I think Battlefield's a smart pick. I think you should go back to Battlefield, personally. Pokemon seems okay. I don't know if you really want to give Luigi all the space, yeah, though. Yeah, Shimon? Really weird. He's been going to Pokemon a lot. Hey, like, he went to Pokemon to. against Father. Why? I don't know. You know, it's like West Balls. Like, West Balls takes uh, Foxes to Yoshi's. It's really not anymore. Not, not anymore. Actually, he did He take was taking s to Dreamland. I was so confused. <laughs> I was I was confused, too. But, like, that same sort of thing. It's just, like, more of a comfort uh, There's phase, that you know? forward throw off stage. He's, he just he wants to opt to go for the edge guard. <gasps> oh! God. Shimon been rolling in a lot on these tech. On the, oh, oh, didn't get it. Back throw? Hmm. Yeah. Smart. Try and go for the edge guard. Luigi, pretty easy to edge guard. Yeah. If you know what you're doing, he's pretty yeah. easy. But it is one of those characters that requires the matchup knowledge. You can't just go in and think you can edge guard Luigi. You yeah. gotta know his options. You gotta know his options. Especially and against a player like Blea, who's going to abuse all of them. And you know, as as easy as it is, because he doesn't really have any like great mix-ups, it still does require execution. Like you have to be willing to go out there and know when to go out there. And like he's so good at these back these down air hitboxes. He knows how to get the spike, he knows how to send him in the right directions. Oh, bad DI. Yeah, you gotta always DI behind Luigi on the throw. Oh. Double poof! Alright, that works. Double poof's so good. Double poof is amazing. I love double poof. Alright, the classic Shamunt where he takes a stock and then leans back. But then when he gets killed, he's gonna lean forward. Just watch out. I promise. What if he What if he doesn't lose any more stocks? Then I guess he'll, uh, well, he's already moved forward. Maybe it's on a timer. Maybe he does it according to the timer. <laughs> I don't know, man. I was definitely playing friendlies uh, with Shimon. We were like warming up for doubles. <laughs> I'm sitting back, like my legs crossed, playing the friendly. He's up close and personal with the TV. Dude, uh, there's the lean back. Oh, there's the lean back. After, after he died, so maybe. It's and a there he goes back in. Maybe it's a combination of both. That that is my hard read on Shimon. <laughs> <laughs> I might not have the in-game reads, but I've definitely got the IRL reads. Oh. Oh, smart. Um, the mix-up being that uh, Blea only does like one or two of the jabs and then wave dashes out. Right. Um, but Blea definitely committed to the full jab combo and just got shield grab for it. It's kind of like a pick your poison thing against Sheik. Yeah. Uh, double spot dodge does Dude, not fall you, for it. You can't double Smart. spot dodge the double spot dodge master. Oh, oh and he punishes the bad misfire. DI. He's going to jump up air. Oh. <gasps> no, he tried to roll oh, the Luigi special. No. All right, this is looking dunzo. Never mind, dude. Dude, Luigi's hard, so hard to edge guard. Dude, you can't edge guard this All character. Right. If he pressed R, 
five frames earlier. Yeah. This is an even game. This, this is an even game. He was at six. Six. I know. It's rough out there, man. It's rough out there. Mm. We're, we were just talking about how easy it is to um, edgeguard Luigi. So it's it's looking like a... Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Shimon's going to get the, the 30 in the handshake, but yep. he 